Montana State is on to the second round of the 2018 FCS playoffs. The Bobcats will be in Fargo on Saturday to face the defending national champion North Dakota State Bison. It's time for four downs, four things you need to know headed into game week. On first down, the Fargo Dome. This is a really tough place to play. Many have entered, few have survived. Since 2010, North Dakota State is 71 and six at home. They'll pack close to 19,000 in there and it gets loud. Playing with poise and handling the environment will be a priority, especially early for Montana State. On second down, the ground game. Both of these teams have a run first approach. In most big sky circles, Montana State is regarded as a team that just never throws the ball. However, on average, the Bobcats attempt three more passes per game than North Dakota State. These are two teams built in a similar image. Establishing the run and stopping it will be priorities on both sides. On third down, North Dakota State can overwhelm you with a scoring avalanche. Six different times this season, the Bison scored three or more touchdowns in a single quarter. For perspective on that, they were held scoreless in a quarter just seven times over 11 games. And finally, fourth down, there's talent all over the field. North Dakota State play, uh, placed a record 15 players on the Missouri Valley All-Conference team, including Offensive Player of the Year quarterback Easton Stick and the Defensive Player of the Year linebacker Jabril Cox. Not only are the Bison well coached, they're supremely talented, which is a big reason why they enter Saturday's game on an FCS best 17 game winning streak. It's Montana State and North Dakota State this Saturday in the second round of the FCS playoffs. Join Dan Davies, Jason Alvin, and me for our broadcast all across the Bobcat Sports Network and on TuneIn. Our pregame coverage takes the air at noon with kickoff set for 1 o'clock. Reporting for MSUBobcats.com, I'm Jay Sanderson.